Hey everyone, welcome back to our newest video. Today, as you can see on the screen here, we're gonna be opening up two wax packs of 1984 Donruss. And in my opinion, this was the nicest set that they produced. I can't speak for what they've done in the last, I don't know, 15 to 20 years. Um, I actually only saw that they had cards this year. Um, but, you know, back in the 80s, this was definitely uh, their big set. And these are just beautiful cards. Uh, the set has a gem in it, Don Mattingly rookie. I actually, to my knowledge, have never even held a Don Mattingly rookie, never mind own one. So uh, that would be lots of fun to find one of those. Uh, Daryl Strawberry would be another one we'd be looking for. Um, and a bunch of rated rookies. I know Joe Carter is one of note. And lots of Hall of Famers. So let's get into these guys and see what we can find. And a puzzle piece here. Does it tell us who it is? Duke Snyder. All right. Okay, so we'll start with a Tim Wallach. Jim Clancy, Diamond King, Tom Foley of the Reds, Rick Camp, Floyd Bannister, Jerry Kuzman, very nice, Mike Young, Moose Haas, Jerry Royster, Brian Harper, Gary Pettis, Ray Knight, Chris Welsh, Joe Price, and Luis DeLeon. So first pack there, it looks like it's pretty much all commons. Move on to the next one here. Our puzzle piece, that definitely looks like Duke Snyder. Okay, so we have Ron Kittle, big home run hitter. Darnell Coles, Brian Clark, Ron Washington, Jack Clark, who was a big star with the Cardinals in the mid 80s. Jim Essien, Bob Horner. Oh, Mike Schmidt, Diamond King, very nice. Oh, we got an Eddie Murray too, there's a good one, Hall of Famer. Damaso Garcia, Keith Atherton, Kevin Bass, Tony Bernazard, Brad Commons, graded rookie and Brian Little. So we didn't find the aforementioned big cards. We did pull Eddie Murray, nice one, Hall of Famer, and a Mike Schmidt Diamond King. Nonetheless, this is a beautiful set and I enjoyed going through these cards and I hope you enjoyed the video and we will see you next time.